What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to the Wrong Agenda Podcast Weekly Recap. I am Jess Dale, and I'm going to go over some of the top stories from the wrongagenda.com website. So Netflix released their numbers, and if you ever wondered how did they come up with these things to put in a top list and the most viewed and most popular, I'm just going to say go to the site. It has the detailed information there, but I'm just going to run through the top 10 most popular titles in each category based on their first 91 days on Netflix. You see how they work that based on their first 91 days on Netflix. But anyway, number one is Wednesday season one, which is not a surprise with 252 million views. Number two is Stranger Things season four with 140 million views. Wow. Wednesday really, really smashed it. Number three is Dharma with uh, 115 million views, Bridgerton, so on, so on. You get the picture. Yeah, Netflix shows get watched a lot. But with the writer strikes and everything and uh, the new laws they have to abide by or say the rules, whatever you want to call it, it's going to get interesting to see uh, how this translates to pay for some of the actors. The next thing is All-Star Weekend. We had a representative fly out to Indiana for All-Star Weekend to join in the festivities and... He had a lot to say about what was going on. Um, All-Star Weekend seems to be losing his luster, he says, and he's wrote a detailed article about what could possibly fix it and bring it back to its glory and excitement that it once had. So y'all definitely go check that out. Next on the list, we have some gaming news. Mortal Kombat 1 released a trailer for Peacemaker, a new character they're about to drop. And, um... Yeah, I did a reaction video to it. If you want to check that out, you can check that out. It'll be down there in the description. And I'm just going to leave it at that. Check it out. And lastly, we have Zeus Network, man. Shout out to them. They came a long way. I remember when they first started and they had like Instagram and YouTube reuse content. Now they have like shows. I hear they're going into scripted programming. I definitely need to holler at them. But yeah, they released a trailer for their new show, Bad vs. Wild with Nick Cannon. Yep, they got Nick Cannon in on the action. And he's basically doing a wild and out with cast from different zoo shows. They even tease a battle between Natalie Nunn and Jocelyn Hernandez. That's what the f you be doing. You be eating hoes ass. How is that going to work? I don't know, but I'll probably check it out just because. And um, yeah, man, zoos keep rocking. They had a cool Mayweather versus Gotti match. Like, they're, they're into everything. But wait, what if they supposed to have a rematch? Whatever happened to that? Hmm. Anyway, uh, yeah, the trailer for that is out. And, um, yeah, check all these articles out on our website, man. Uh, hopefully this week we'll have some big news to share and a lot of discussion. Don't forget to comment, like, and definitely subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. We got a lot of media content and dope interviews we want to get out to y'all. But we got to bring these numbers up, people. Hit the subscribe, man, please. And uh, let us know you want this to keep going. All right, see y'all. Just there, out.